Nancy, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a special guest, surprisingly. It is my <laughs> sister. And today we are going to be doing a little DIY chocolate covered pretzels. We're also going to be making uh, Reese cups that are pretty easy and simple to make. So, yes. And my mom might be popping in. <laughs> because she really wants to make she her really debut. She really wants to make her debut in this video. She wants to like, make a little cameo on the video. She keeps All talking right. about it. So, yeah, yeah. She's like, okay, I'll just step in a little bit. Just but well, you might need help. Oh, see, she's in behind. What I need is parchment paper, different colored chocolates, different colored sprinkles, pretzels, pretzel. and this thing. And some sprinkles. Oh, I already said that. And this contraption and a knife. A knife? A knife. <laughs> Malibu! The door's open, the door's open. She's gonna run. Oh, she ran outside. Oh, Malibu! Candy melts? No. Okay. So we're gonna, let's do pink chocolate first. This is the kind of chocolate we got. You can get this at Pacatan's or Michael's. So, so just fill it about a little half. more than halfway. Wait, Maddie. <laughs> I always put white chocolate in it because it makes it creamier. Take about a handful, a little less than a handful. It's about here. I believe to the little stripe It's like to the thing. line, yeah. So now I'll take it to the microwave. Right. Yes. Now you're just gonna put it in the microwave. 45 seconds. 45 seconds. So now we just put it in again for 30 more seconds. This is kind of a process. Once it's out, now you just gotta mix it more, and it's starting to get really creamy. Second cameo. I have chocolate in my face, but in the meantime, we're going to be using our making molds. They basically look like little baby bottles. Blows up with chocolate. And basically, do the same process. I'm coming up, filling mine up with like milk chocolate, then adding some white chocolate into it. Is it good enough? I think it needs a little more. Let's see. Third cameo. Oh, okay. Come on, I do this. You take it out of the microwave. Now you're gonna take your pretzel, dip it in, kind of swirl it around, get it on, get it all on there. You pull it out and it's perfect. And so what you're gonna do is you're just gonna lay it on your parchment paper. Whoa! Good job. Perfect. And now I'm gonna do this one. What color should I do this? Yellow? Why not? Putting them on the on the parchment paper and sprinkling some sprinkles. So this first row we did with sprinkles. Second row we did no sprinkles. <laughs> yep. And we're doing pink because pink is so cute. Yep. So just keep repeating the process. And make sure to not put your whole finger on this if it just came out of the microwave because it's really, really hot. So now that we have the pretzels done, we are going to move on to the peanut butter cups. So let's get to that. You will need. Not fully. Okay. <laughs> what you will need is a peanut butter cup thing. Mold thing to Basically, and you will need peanut butter. Peanut butter. Preferably Jif. Jif, because Jif is awesome. Creamy. Not chunky, because that's gross. Well, some people will also need uh, make and mold. Okay, so we got this all from Pacatans. If you guys live in Pittsburgh, you probably know what that is, but. It's like a craft store full thingy machines from Bacon Mold, and we're just gonna put all a bunch of white chocolate into this and fill it about the whole way, right? Yeah. 
Okay, and then we will pop it into the microwave and then come back when it is done. Bye. So we are doing half of white chocolate and then the other half is going to be milk chocolate. So the next step is slightly trickier. You're going to take a spoon with peanut butter, just like this, and you're going to take another spoon. And just to help you, you're just going to take the other spoon to flick it off into oh. okay. the mold. Oh, yeah. Totally. We're doing the chocolate side now. And if you guys are wondering, the reason we're kind of moving really fast is because chocolate can harden and it can dry. What we did with the white chocolate ones is we put white chocolate on the bottom and then peanut butter and then white chocolate over top of it just so it'll cover up the peanut butter. Um, and on the chocolate we did the same. I meant on the milk chocolate one we did the same but with obviously milk chocolate. Is that good? Yep, that's perfect. And you'll probably need this. Ow! <laughs> Maddie runs into cabinet. <laughs> and you will probably need someone's help to do this. I don't recommend you doing this alone because I don't understand how to do this. Okay. Make sure you don't do too much chocolate like I, I meant too much peanut butter like I did on that one because it won't stay down. I'm just going to flatten this. It'll flatten when we, I'll show you how to flatten it. Oh yeah. Okay, and just so next we are going to take plop them in the fridge. First step. <gasps> yes. So we will see you guys after um, our chocolate is ready in the fridge and after our pretzels are dry. Make sure you put the Reese's cups in for 20 minutes, and we're just kind of letting those sit for however long. So. Peace out, Girl Scout. Okay, so now we're going to be doing a taste test of the little Reese's cups and the pretzels. So, here's. I'm gonna try a chocolate one because I'm excited. I made a very good one. Yeah, so. I didn't say three, two, one. Mmm. The hard. That's so good. Mm hmm. <gasps> Look how satisfying. <laughs> it looks like a real Reese's cup. Awesome. I give these an A plus. Time for the pretzels. Pretzel time. One, two, three. Mm. So me and Maddie were editing this and we were looking at that video and we do the same exact reaction and we look like twins. So just wanted to get that out of the way. Yep. Amazing. Stellar. What? These are good. Mm. Oh, yeah. Thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button down below. And comment down below what you want me to do next week. And the fan of the week is, drum roll please. Is this cool person. So congrats to you and I'll BFF you on Musical.ly. Okay, so thanks for watching, bye. I say that. Okay, so peace out. I'm done here. <laughs>